So guys, you've wondered about an NFC ring, but you're just unsure if it's worth buying one. Let's take a look. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Again, if you are new here, please don't forget, subscribe to my channel. You'll be notified anytime I do any tech news or tech reviews. And if you're a returning viewer, welcome back. So, you have got or want to get an NFC ring, but you don't know what it can be used for or whether you should buy one. Well, I purchased one because I'm doing a quick series on cheap Chinese tech or just cheap tech in general to find out if it's worth the purchase. Now, this ring, again, it's it's not a bad ring. It's, it, you know, it's, it's quite nice. Um, I got this from Amazon and it was 75 pence plus two pound postage and packaging. Now, two pounds 75 shipped from China for an NFC ring, I think is pretty good value. Um, so yeah, under three dollars. And it remember, it doesn't require any power whatsoever. It just writes straight to the ring. You do not need to charge it. It does not need a, a battery. It's just, it is what it is. It's its own thing. And what do you, could you use it for? I mean, it's got several uses and I believe that it could be useful for several people. Now, we're gonna go and take a look and we're just gonna have a look on the desk just here, you know, what you can do with the ring and what best application to use with this particular product. So guys, when you get this ring, I mean, it's not a bad ring, it's quite nice. It's not particularly, you know, dazzling or blingy, but you know, it'll do the job quite nice just sitting on your finger. When you do get it, it does come, well, the one I ordered, in this bag, which does have a QR code on it. Now, I've not scanned the QR code because I have no idea where it takes me or what it will do to my phone, whether it'll upload software or anything like that from a third party that I don't know what it will do to my phone. So I just discard this completely and I just brought in my phone. So what I did is I just go to the Google Play Store and I just typed in NFC Ring App and it'll give you a, a load of different um, apps that you can install. I just tapped NFC Tools just here. I have already installed it on my phone, but if you open it, when you do first open it, it will give you how does it work, welcome to, you, to NFC Tools and give you a guide of what it does but i'm not going to go through all of this because you just basically need to know the, the what well, the basics really so if you go to the second tab here so you've got you've got read you've got write so you can go to write so that means basically you're going to put information onto your ring here so you just go to add record now this is just a basic tutorial it doesn't go into depth but again, on the app, it gives you so many things to add. So like text, a URL, custom URL, a, add a link to a search, social media networks. So you can link to all of your, well, most of your uh, social media sites, um, an application record, uh, add a mail record, add a contact, a phone number, SMS, a location. There is all sorts you can do. Um, and one of the best ones, I do believe, is the emergency contact information. And again, you can just select your language, you, you can put your name, date of birth, address, any allergies, blood type, organ donor, anything like that. And you can add it to the ring. So let's just pick something simple. So if I just go to text, I'll just type in, uh, hi, it's Aiden. Okay, so once you've done that, it will tell you to, to get it to the ring. You've got to write it to the ring. So you just press write, and then it prompts you to approach an NFC tag, which in this case is the ring. You just hold the ring to the back of the point of your phone where your NFC reader is. And as you can see, it said write complete. Done, and that is it. 
that is literally it. So if I close down all of my apps, so as you can see, there is nothing open, no recent items open. If I just take the ring and I hold it, so for me, it's about here. It just comes up. Hi, it's Aiden. And I shall show you again, just to make sure that it's uh, no trick. I just hold it to the back of my phone. Hi, it's Aiden. Again, it's absolutely fantastic. And this, you know, again, could be really good if you have got maybe an elderly relative or somebody maybe that's got dementia or is forgetful about where they live or any dietary requirements or any medication they take. Because I do think that the um, emergency information is, is fantastic. I do think it's something that people could use. Again, it's going on the basis that people will know what this is. Now, you're not going to see a ring and go, oh, your details are on there. But if you can tell somebody that their details are on there, they might remember just to, it might be too much for somebody to remember all of this, but if they can just remember that their details are on a ring, then they don't need to remember all of this. You know, even if it's just a text or a, a URL. So you can put a link to your YouTube channel right here. So if you are out and about and people say, oh, what's your YouTube channel? You can just say, I've got it on my ring. Let me show you and just ping it to their phone and you're all done. So guys, this ring could be a lifesaver. It can be used by so many people in many different ways. I personally will be putting my, well, a link to my YouTube channel on this ring. So if I'm out in the public or with the public or if I'm out in public even, if people ask me about my channel, I can just put the ring on and scan it onto their phone and it'll come up straight away and they can choose to subscribe if they wish. But the big issues for this, and I think is gonna be its best use, is for those people with memory problems, with dementia, with Alzheimer's, to give them a little bit of their independence back. Because with the emergency information, with the fact that you can add your address, personal details, all of that, they can go back out into the open world and they can not have to worry about what they can eat, where they live. They don't have to remember all of those details. They can be put onto a ring and all they have to do is remember to scan it onto their phone. Now, I'm not saying this is going to work for everyone, but for a lot of people, this could be a, a lifesaver. You know, you could go to a restaurant and again, if they've got memory problems or they don't know what their allergies are or they can't remember, put it on the ring, scan it, and then it will come up on their phone. Absolutely fantastic. So guys, let me know, comment below. Have you bought one for yourself or have you bought one for a friend or family member? Please comment below, let me know how you use it or if you've had to use it. Because I genuinely do think that this could benefit so many people in so many different ways. And before I get going, don't forget, if you've enjoyed this, please press the like button. I would be eternally grateful. And if you've really enjoyed it, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and you'll be notified anytime I do any tech news or tech reviews. So guys, I shall see you soon. Bye.